Hello, thank you for joining me today. This is another two minute tip video tutorial by Amanda Fowler of inspiringinking.com. Today's video tutorial is the first in a series on knots and bows. Um, I consider myself a bow impaired and do struggle with, with bows and other forms of ribbon decoration. So I thought I would share a few hints and tips with you um, because I know I'm not the only one. I'm going to just use a plain card blank. Hopefully you'll be able to see a bit better. This ribbon is the new wide ribbon that you'll find in the autumn winter catalogue. It's cherry cobbler, um, grow grain and it's, it's got a lovely stripe. Okay, so what you're going to do is start with your ribbon central um, to your card and then pull the two ends up. Now if you are a girl guide like me you will know um, this is actually a reef knot but I'm going to take you step by step through this. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take the right hand tail and place it over the left. So right over left and then you're going to tuck that underneath. Now at this point I actually turn whatever I'm, I'm working on and I just make sure that the ribbon is evened out and flattened. So then I've actually got the tails are running east and west and I'm going to take the east tail and I'm still holding down the centre bit and I'm going to put it as though it's going north. Now I use my middle finger underneath to pin that down so that's going north. Then I take my west tail and that is going to go over the top and underneath and through that hole. Now I hope you can see that so I'm just going to pull that tail through. Now the important thing at this point is to pull the tails of ribbon north and south. If you start twisting them you won't get a, a flat knot. And you want to pull the north bit more because you want that to tuck in and then you're going to pull the south and you'll end up with a flat knot. You may just need to just tidy it up a little bit. Then use a pair of ribbon scissors and cut the ends at a jaunty angle. It means then that people don't actually know this isn't a bow. It actually looks really decorative. So there you go. Really quick and simple. A flat knot. Well, I've actually known in my classes as Amanda's knot because this is actually the form of decoration I use most on my cards. Because as I said, I'm bow impaired. So thank you very much for stopping by for my two minute tip. I'll see you again soon.